The new Xpeng G9 has arrived in stores with laser radar and 5C AI battery as standard. The overall appearance of the Xpeng G9 has not changed significantly. On the front, there will be a split headlight design consisting of a plug-in LED light strip and a horizontal dual-zone headlight housing at the bottom, and the front perimeter will again be decorated with dot rectangle chrome. However, the new vehicle will cancel the original high tower lidar. On the sides of the vehicle, although there is no significant change in the overall body structure, the newly introduced black warrior paint effect, combined with the latest model smoked black spoke rims with built-in large brake calipers, the side profile of the vehicle looks more handsome, and the body performance style is also deepened. At the rear, the new car has a simple layout structure again, plug-in type taillights equipped with rich LED light sources are used as the main body. The interior of the G9 does not have many adjustments either, but while continuing to use the floating full LCD instrument panel and large-sized central control screen plus co-pilot entertainment screen combination, the new style multifunction dual-spoke steering wheel will also be used. It is stated that the system chip of the new car will be upgraded from the original 8155P to 8295. Although the laser radar will be cancelled, it will be replaced by a pure visual intelligent driving solution. In other words, the new generation Turing AI intelligent driving system is supported by dual NVIDIA Drive Auron intelligent driving chips, 508 TOPS processing power, and 26 sensing hardware, 11 cameras, 3mm wave radars, 12 ultrasonic radars and has functions such as high-speed NGP, urban NGP, AI driving, AI parking, and will even be a standard element of the entire series. In terms of passenger performance, the body dimensions will be 4891-1937-1670mm, the wheelbase will be 2998mm, and it will again adopt the big five-seater layout. Such a size arrangement basically means that there will be no obvious adjustment in interior performance. However, the new car will feature new seats covered in Nappa chrome-free tanned leather and will come with a microfiber microfiber roof as standard. All seats, including the rear seats, will even be equipped with functions such as heating slash ventilation slash massage. At the same time, extensive improvements have been made to the three electric system. The new car will be equipped with a full-range 800V silicon carbide platform and the maximum power of the rear-wheel drive version will be increased to 258 kilowatts. The overall maximum power of the all-wheel drive dual-motor version will be increased to 423 kilowatts. As for battery life, the new car will be equipped with 5C supercharged AI batteries as standard, which can be charged from 10% to 80% in just 12 minutes. The new car's AI chassis system will also be updated, and the entire range will be equipped with dual-chamber air suspension as standard. Thank you.